A.O. Smith's line of Guardian replacement motors is equipped with electronics that constantly monitor pool conditions and automatically shut off the motor and pump if a full body entrapment is detected. The Guardian's built-in safety vacuum release system, known as SVRS, complies with the requirements mandated by the Virginia Graham Baker Pool and Spa Act and is listed to the ASME A112.19.17 standard for suction lift applications. Suction entrapment can happen to anyone, regardless of age, health, or swimming prowess. Children are more vulnerable as they tend to play near or sit on drain covers. By blocking the drain, a person can cause a rare but dangerous situation. The suction of the blocked drain can generate a powerful vacuum effect exceeding 400 pounds of pressure, so powerful that many entrapment victims are unable to free themselves. This can lead to serious injuries and even death. The Guardian motor calibrates automatically to the specific hydraulic and filtration characteristics of a pool or spa. The electronics constantly monitor the input power of the motor. Anytime the Guardian detects a change in input power, the motor and pump are shut off automatically. A.O. Smith developed a demonstration unit to help educate consumers about the Guardian motor and how it helps prevent full body suction entrapment. This unit operates just like your pool's pump system, only on a much smaller scale. You have the pool water circulating through the pump system powered by an electric motor, in this case, a Guardian replacement motor. After the Guardian replacement motor has been installed on the pump and the power turned on, it will begin the three-minute process of calibrating to the unique conditions of the pool. Alternate flashing LEDs indicate that the motor is calibrating. Once it completes the calibration process, the Guardian will go into run mode, as indicated by a constant green LED. The pool is now protected by the Guardian's safety vacuum release system. Now we will test the Guardian motor by simulating an entrapment event. When placing a ball over the suction outlet, representative of a main drain blockage, we cause the input power to drop rapidly from the pool's normal running conditions. The Guardian will fault and the motor and pump system should shut off in less than three seconds. The Guardian will then flash a fault code, indicating why the motor was shut down. Note the flashing red LED. In this case, we should see a fault 31, indicative of an entrapment situation. The pattern of flashes is, blink the tens digit, short pause, blink the ones digit, short pause, then a solid red LED for three seconds, and repeat. Once we remove the blockage, the Guardian motor will attempt to restart automatically four minutes later. Then, after a three minute startup period, the Guardian once again starts monitoring motor input power. If conditions are still not normal, the unit will fault again and begin flashing the appropriate fault code. The Guardian will attempt to restart four times. If the Guardian continues to detect a problem, it will automatically go into lockup mode to protect the pump system from damage caused by low water flow or abnormal power fluctuations. A lockup requires a manual reset to resume motor operation. In addition to the manual reset option, the Guardian motor also allows you to bypass the SVRS monitoring function when the need arises. For instance, you can use the 30-minute bypass mode when vacuuming the pool, back flushing filters, replacing filters, or clearing a large volume of air from the pool plumbing system. The Guardian motor offers you an economical, easy-to-install layer of protection. If you need to replace your pool or spa motor, why not consider the Guardian motor from A.O. Smith.